Yesterday, we reported the president told GM to get the Lordstown plant open. And today, President Trump is urging UAW Local 1112 President Dave Green to do something about the stopped production at GM Lordstown. Take a look at this tweet from earlier this afternoon. Trump said he wants Green to get his act together and produce. Also in the tweet, he tells Green to, quote, stop complaining and get the job done, end quote. We also just heard from T Congressman Tim Ryan on the president's tweet, and he's not happy about it. Take a listen to what he has to say. To pick Dave Green out of as complicated of a situation as this is with, with General Motors and the international union and the car market, he picks the local union guy here who's been dealing with all of the families and all of the pain and all of the hurt and to take a cheap shot at him I think is it's Bush League. I mean it's it, it is as mean spirited as it gets because we've been with Dave a bunch and he's just he's on the front lines here and there's a lot of pain and that the president doesn't really understand that. UAW Local 1112 President Dave Green also released a statement this afternoon in response to the president's tweet. Green says the following, we're doing everything we can with the Drive It Home campaign to convince GM CEO Mary Barra to reinvest in GM Lordstown. As Mary Barra has said, GM plans to discuss our fate with the UAW in the fall, and we're focused on getting a new product in Lordstown. Green continued with folks here in the Mahoning Valley are true blue, hardworking, loyal, dedicated, and ready to help GM and this country build the cars and trucks of the future. Ohio Senator Sherrod Brown also responded to the president's tweet today with not one, but two tweets in support of Dave Green and GM Lordstown. Brown's first tweet reads, quote, Mr. President, Dave Green and the workers at UAW Local 1112 have shown grit and determination in the face of adversity, fighting for Lordstown from day one. Instead of attacking workers, it's past time you stood up to GM and joined the fight. The second tweet followed saying, quote, if you want action on Lordstown and if you want to fight back for American auto workers, work with us to pass the American Cars American Jobs Act now. And new details at just 6.30 this evening, President Trump tweeted again about GM Lordstown, saying he just spoke to GM CEO Mary Barra about the o Lordstown, Ohio plant. He says in part, quote, I am not happy that it's closed when everything else in our country is booming. I asked her to sell it or do something quickly. She blamed the UAW union. I don't care. I just want it open.